Ah, more work. Work all day and now infinite overtime at night. Look at all the money flowing. We're doing fantastic over here. Now I think that, oh, here we go. We got someone in pulling in right now. All right, let's, uh, oh yeah. Oh, this, this is a wreck. You're gonna need more power. You need all the power. First things first. We gotta, we gotta remove a bunch of this stuff here. You're not gonna need that or but this. None of that. I don't know what that is. You don't need that no more. Looks like you got some chain links in there. I don't even know what that's from. Is this a double A battery? This is like a double A battery. You don't need that. I don't even know. Is this a, is this a lawnmower head? This looks like a weed whacker head. All right. So that was the issue, okay? The issue was you had a bunch of random junk inside your engine. Now we need to put some top quality parts in there. First thing you're gonna need for more power. Boom, protein shake. Right in there. The next thing you're gonna need, boom, protein bars. Right over there. That's masculine. That's <laughs> meatheadish. That's how we, that's how we do. It's gonna lean your engine out. Legitimately and then last I got a special extra item over here just for you wait until you see this uh, This just came in special delivery. Oh Here we go That's what you need for maximum power in your engine. There we go. We're gonna throw that in Whoa, whoa, oh <laughs> oh, no. oh Oh my god What have I done? <laughs> What is this, 2009? Hello, everybody, guys, still plays, and we're back with more Job Simulator. I feel like it's almost mandatory anytime you say simulator to say the year. Isn't that how they do it? It's like always whatever simulator 2018, or nowadays they just skip ahead a year, 2019. It's like the new iPhone or something like that. Anyway, we're doing more auto mechanic work, but this time we're doing it in the ultimate infinite overtime to try and mess up cars as much as possible. Now, supposedly, there's some hidden little gags and stuff over here at nighttime. I'm very curious. Now, from what I understand, do you- How long is this? Bot hard? How do you feel about the impending release of this movie? When, every time I go in to make a new movie, you know, I really, I do some soul searching. I really like each- Hold on a bit. Specific mood or feeling and sleep cycle in Seattle. Is this Rick and Morty? Is why Hollybot is the voice of a console generation. It is, isn't it? Oh my god. I kind of wonder, like, part of me wonders how long it goes on for. Let's uh let's see what we can mess up here car-wise. Like I said, I've never really done the infinite overtime yet. We can start adding some of the new mods and stuff like that too. Come on in, Granny. Actually, you may be a young person. I really can't tell. All you bots look the same to me. These tires have too much drag. Can I get some new ones? That kind of sounded like, like, bot prejudice. I didn't mean for it to sound like that, but I totally understand it. Let's check your tires out over here. Well, the reason your tires have too much drag is because you're at about negative 5 million percent tread. That is the issue. Now, in case you're wondering what sort of special tools you need to get the tire off, you really just need a strong set of fingers, okay? We're like the Kurt Russell of uh, of auto tire removal. Now, if you're like me, you're gonna always miss that freaking hoop. Is this a battery? Huh. That's interesting. Give yourself a little nuclear touch. Ty Lopez would be proud. Now, when you want tires, you want the bling blingiest tires there is. Right over here, concrete Fred, Fred Flintstone tires. That's what you want. Just gotta really shove them on real slow. Oh my god, this was a lot harder than I had previously entered. What does it take to get the tire on here? There, go get on there. You gotta be kidding me. Do you see that? What are the chances of that happening? That's like throwing a bottle flip from the Empire State Building onto a moving Winnebago that's being towed by a Mack truck. Like that is, that is absolutely impossible. I can't believe I managed to do that. All right, let's get the rest of these tires on over here. We got one tire left. I don't even want to try it again. I, I'm afraid of knocking it off now. <laughs> All right, well, I should have known I'd never get close enough to do that. All right, tires are fixed. What else you want, lady? I'm not gonna lie. What are we allowed to shove in here, Duracell? Oh, can you? Oh, it's Derpacell. Mmm, Derpacell. Can you like mess with anything? Like, can I take this out even though it's not a problem? Like, I don't need that one. Let's uh, we're being very inefficient here. Like, can I just? Can I shove that in there? Oh, I guess I can. You could put nuclear power inside of the engine. 
I honestly I would have everything run on nuclear power now You don't just want one or two pistons and I you don't want to put the same piston in each time I would alternate pistons and then you know what why not put a couple of extra pistons in there Honestly the more pistons in any engine the better we're gonna get like 675,000 gerbil power out of this thing right now there we go the old hamster wheel is really turning more pistons more pistons You're gonna want a couple of those right there and um Whatever this is. Let's go ahead and put that in there. I think we're set. It'll fit. Print the bill. That'll be $69,900, lady. There you go. This looks great. I'll bet it does. There's still a wheel sitting on your antenna. How did I do that? Can I get rid of this? Here we go. Sorry. Where'd my, where'd my thing go? Oh, it's gone. My tire that was sitting on the backboard. I felt so good about that. Human, I definitely own this car. I just need some minor modifications. <laughs> Gotta look good when I win. All right, that doesn't sound suspicious at all. Is it just a paint job? You got anything going on? Oh, you got some piston issues over here. I can already tell. For for this particular car, I would like to go with a nice sunny orange, perhaps. I think that's really gonna bring out the color of the pleather. So let's go and bring that down there. Now you don't want to just paint one portion of the car. I like to get the paint everywhere, all over the steering wheel, onto the back seating area. The pistons are shot over here. Let's go ahead and get rid of those. Can you can you do anything into a thing over here? You probably can. If you turn a piston into a into a thing like this, can you still use it as a piston? Oh, it's a broken piston chunk. Now it doesn't fit in there. Oil. Oh. Yeah, no problem. What do you get? What, what do you put? Do we have to? Here, let me check the old dipstick over there. You ain't got nothing in there. Now for fluids, you may think to yourself, oil is the most obvious, but I like to go with just more gasoline. Because quite honestly, if you're going to go ahead and get as much power as possible, gasoline provides a fantastic amount of energy. Here we go. You may have heard the Metallica song where it says, uh, quench your thirst in gasoline. Don't do this at home, kids. This is the monetization right there. There we go. Fant oh, you know what? I have a better idea. Can I get some of the fluid out? We're going to try that next time. I'm going to, I have an idea for next time. That'll be $7,800. Enjoy it on the way home. I think we're going to do like zero G in a little bit and see how tough it is to do that. But first, I want to replace someone's fluids with vomit. That sounds terrible, but in this game, they'd want you to do it. So what's going on there, Don Quixote? Okay. I'm going to need you to take a few miles off the odometer. We can't let anyone know. All right. What is this? Ferris Bueller's day off? That's how you do it. I hear fossil fuels if there's one out of style, but I'm a fan of the classics. If there's one thing I learned from 90s movies, it's that you can take a super expensive vehicle, put it up on lifts, run it backwards forever, and it didn't work. Uh, uh, in case you guys don't know, spoiler alert, Ferris Bueller and his buddy, uh, it didn't end up happening correctly for him. Now, this is it. We're going to get to put gas inside the gas tank but i don't just want to put gas in there there's something very specific i want to do so we're going to go ahead and open this we're going to grab our gas and he's going to get second hand gas i'm very curious to see how this works here we go there we go second hand gas how oh yeah does it count does it work is it filling up it is not filling up does it have to be gas or can it be anything like could it be just energy could it be delicious energy drink like, if we drink this, no problem, right? Does that work as gas? Hold on. Oh, it does work, I think. All right, I've been vomiting into this guy's car for a while. It doesn't look like we can use just anything. We can't use vomit. I think you can use some of this other stuff, though. Like, we could probably throw some Tabasco sauce in there. Oh, yeah, that works perfectly. A little bit of both, actually. Get you better gas mileage like that. That's what we want. No refunds. Yes. Now I'm ready to drift. Now get out of my shop and take some extra energy with you. Extra energy. Here's some extra get. Never mind. Bye. All right. Zero gravity. Well, it says low gravity, but realistically, I feel like low gravity is like zero point something 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 one because it ain't much. Oh, we got energy man up in here. All right. Oh, you're going to get an extra special tune up for that one, girly. First things first. I got to see if the vomit flies in the air. Oh. Oh, it does. Oh, it's horrifying. Oh, it's like a beautiful mist of high octane regurgitation. <laughs> like I'm gonna, what does that say? Made from 100% real dino bones? Blast from the past. $599, mother of God. Go uh, over to the backside here. 
Now, how easy is it to put gas in when there's no... It does go in. It maybe maybe if you really shove the nozzle in. Oh my god. Oh, it totally works. That works just fine. Maybe we'll even throw a little bit of headlight changer in there. There we go. A little green and pink. Now does that work? Totally works. Sponsors new dangly bits. Hang some of them so I can get sponsored. All right, dangly bits. Got it. Right over here to the decor. Now the real tr the real trick is can you get your dangly bits in from way downtown? Now I like to handle my dangly bits from the underside. Okay, some people like to go overhand, but I go underhand on the dangly bits, and you should try it as well. Now, from right about here, I think if we throw it... Okay, I was totally off. Let's try this one over here. Maybe like that? Maybe you have to hold it. Maybe there's no choice. Maybe you have no choice, but yeah, you gotta hold it. That's too bad. I kind of hope... I... the car and show me the damages. Can you paint this in zero G? Does it work? How does it flow? Nope. Paint works just fine. Like, it's no big deal. Okay, what is this? Is that our is that our mascot? Oh my god, our mascot's flying through the air. I didn't know he was free floating like that. Actually, come to think of it, hold on. I'm very curious how much of this stuff. Oh crap, I just hit my green screen. I wonder how much of this stuff we can free. Gotta throw that D20. Here we go. No, that doesn't work. Come on, critical hit. Critical hit. Now I need lower than that. Got the coffee mug. It didn't go flying though. You gotta be kidding me. That was like the best throw ever. I'm never gonna be able to do that again. Never mind, I totally did it twice in a row. There it is. Coffee mugs flying. Get that plant going as well. Come here, D20. Boom! Plants flying. I know we can get that trophy down up there too. Come on, from what? Oh, hold on now. Come on, LeBron. Make it happen. I think it ricocheted off something. That was kind of odd. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it lost too much momentum. Ugh. Ready for this? Trophyception. Right there, trophyception. Got it on YouTube, everyone saw it. All right, lady, I managed to do this. It, were you a guy or, or a female? I don't remember now. I, I've been so busy trying to get trophies into trophies. It's all kind of blurring together, man. Here we go. Now I can get back to my race. What was that? What? Oh, I've been promoted. I don't know exactly how that happened. Our poor guy over there is still doing his Everything thing too. Everything is possible if you put your mind to it. Here's a promotion. Yay, I'm the human of executive director of employees. There's nowhere for me to put this because there's no gravity. Hi. I think this bin is hot. Can you upgrade my diesel car? I think a new color will cover up these dents. Can you help me out? Diesel, you say? First off, if you're running diesel, you need... Oh, there's no, there's actually, like, there's no, all right, I guess this is the color that you're going to get for your diesel car. I kind of wanted to give you, like, a, a nice, maybe, like, a, like, a champagne I mean, gray or something. Can you actually shove anything in here, or does it have to be the one item? Oh, it does, doesn't it? How much horsepower does each thing of nuclear power add, do you think? What do you think, right? Is this plutonium? Is this, uh, I don't know what all, what, I, I'm gonna start just spouting off elements that aren't actually radioactive. Is this argon? Is this, uh, what else you got over there? Neon? In case you're wondering how to stay up all night long, in order to continue working and making stacks of cash, just go ahead and grab a random tube of radioactive waste and then shove it into some of your pores. Don't do this in real life because if you do, it's gonna be demonetization time. All right, now that we have enough power, should be able to close all that right there. Drop her on down. I think that's all you wanted, right? Just a couple of different things there. I wonder if I can steal stuff from your car before you leave. No. Just getting him a couple of complimentary items for the road. I'm very curious to see if like, because it's inside of the car, if it'll continue to move with it or if it'll just leave and this stuff will just be floating there. Some of it did go with the car. Now I want to stuff the inside of the car full of crap just to see if it goes. Now, is it going to run into this? Is it going to go sending it flying? Oh, you know what? Technically, it was too high. I got to put some lower stuff down. Oh, never mind. It just went right through it. Hold on. Let me let me see if I can get this stuff inside. Do you have like an open window or anything? Can I just open your door? Oh, perfect. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Now, if you want to make your car hot, you need enough of these and you need enough of where's more of the hot sauce you play a hot sauce right here there you go all the hot sauce all the energy drinks like so 
And then let's kind of- I thought something would happen. I thought maybe it would start spraying around in there, but that didn't happen. I actually want to fill this entire car up. All right, there we go. I think we've got enough special gifts for our our uh, our person over here. We've racked up a seven thousand dollar bill for them too while doing this. So honestly, it's I like to say it's free, but it's really not. Here's an extra piston for you too. There we go, right there. I may even fill an entire car with pistons. What were we supposed to do originally here? Were we like painting a car or something? I don't even remember. Are we done? No, I don't think we're done. I think we have to paint it. Hold on. She wants the hood ornament. You boys know what she's getting. I've always wanted to give this away to someone. So she's going to be the first one to get it. The nuclear hood ornament. What happens if you put more than one thing in there? Like, what happens if you put a bunch of stuff in here? Will it only do one thing at a time? Or will it turn it all into one giant conglomeration of Megatron level hood ornament goo? Oh, it turns them all into hood ornaments. Oh, what happened to the... Oh, it's up here. I was going to say, what happened to my nuclear one? It, like, went away for a moment. Drop the car. That'll be a cold, crisp $10,000, please. And let's see if she can drive away with all that stuff in there. Hold on. Finally, this car suits my personality. Dude, I gotta see this. Go ahead, get in there. Let me see what happens. Ready? <laughs> oh, this is good. All right. Okay. Is that it, or was there anything additional to that? Can we knock that mug out of his hand? I really hoped that she would shove her way past all that debris, and she did not let me down. I got the coffee mug, but he's not letting go of it. Man, he's got it like a death grip on that thing. He has no power left. He's like a like the last moment on the cell phone. You got five percent, and the freaking screen starts to go dark. All right. Let's make a little bit more money here and see if we can mess up this last car. I need an upgrade to maximize my drifting. This RGB value is not right. Can you give me a new coat of paint? Hmm, 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 hmm. Uh, dee, dee, dee. Don't need any of that. What happens when you lose all this stuff? Like, does it fail to work or anything, or do they just keep driving away? I wish I could crack this open and put the liquid inside of it, but I guess you can't. Now, how about the red energy? We did the green energy. How about this? What happens if you thrust this inside? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's exactly what you want to have happen. Right there. Perfect. I'm even going to get a little bit of this. It, just kind of shake it, and then you move your face into it. It works real good. There we go. Now, if there's a car I love, it's one that's spewing out fire. What happens if you put gas on the fire? Is there, like, extra explosions or anything like that? Oh, that would have been cool if you could light the gas on fire or you could light the fire on more fire and more explosiveness with the gas But it doesn't look like you can nuclear fire Anything right now. I feel like we're violating all kinds of safety precautions now I don't know about you boys, but I like to have a, a light toasting on my donuts. There we go Donuts roasting over an open gas fire. That's probably pretty bad for your health, but oh that's the taste when you're when you're a real motorhead like this, that's what you that's what you live on. That's what you thrive on right there. What is this running on? This is running on coffee? Do we even have that? Hold on a second over here. Was there a coffee can that powers stuff? Oh, there is. It's all the way on the bottom. I had no idea. Hold on. We need to make this car the most powerful car there is. It needs to have more horsepower than any other car. So we are going to have to replace the pistons. All right, we're going to do that. But on top of replacing the pistons, I want this thing to be spewing freaking lightning. Now, in order for us to do that, I think you have to grab... Hold on, let me see something over here. How about if we pour this in? Does that get us... Ah, that gets you kind of like a, a light, a light colorish color. Oh, here we go. Hold on. That's the dark red that you want. There we go. The old energy drink friggin' does it. All right, let's put, oh, you know what? This needs more power. This has to be the most power of anything that we've done yet. Coffee's got to go. That's going in. All right, we got as much red energy and freaking destructonium as we can possibly shove in here. It's just, come on, baby. No, 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 get in there, get in there. 
Get in there. God, it's like, it's like herding cats. All the way down. All the way down. Come on. Come on. Get in there. Get in there. There we go. I didn't think we were close to that hood. I wanted to see what would happen if you, if you did the red energy drink into the hood ornament. It kind of looks exactly the same. All right, got the gray cam going over here. We got nuclear power. It's like a, it's like a, a an episode of uh, Cribs, but with cars. It's like Caribs, sort of. We got nuclear power on the inside of the car. We got nuclear power in the cab area of the car. I got flames coming out the back. Do the flames get bigger if you pump the uh, the gas? Let's see. I wonder if you can actually see from here. Hold on. Let me. Oh, where's my hand at? If I go like this. Are we seeing anything? Let's drop this dude's car, make some money, and then get up out of here. That's going to be it for tonight, man. I'm tired. I've been working for the last, like, 36 hours straight. You can't get over here because there's the sauce in the way. Enjoy your nuclear flame spewing car, baby. Hope you like it. Guys, that's going to be it for this episode of Job Simulator, where we tried to make nuclear power and we got to listen to Rick and Morty. We also got to knock everything off the shelves with the Zero G. I kind of enjoyed that. Is there anything else that we're missing over here in Auto Mechanic on the Infinite Overtime? Feel free to smother the like button in uh, hot sauce if you want to make the YouTube machine happy. Until the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.